President Trump yesterday was the first time I saw this clip. You live in New Mexico, of course. He was asked a question by a reporter about if he's ever going to declassify the Roswell files. And instead of dismissing them, he actually said he's seen them. Very interesting stuff, but he doesn't know about declassification. So what do you think about the president not just totally kind of brushing away the topic as we've seen them do in the past? I think that he has been read in on more about the extraterrestrial civilization than any of us would ever have thought possible. There's a reason why, but it's better I don't go into it. And that makes it very, very difficult to understand what his day-to-day priorities and tweets are about. Because if he really does have some understanding of the large and huge scope, both historically and going into the future, there's no question in my mind, whether it's Elon Musk, we are going to have a base on Mars. It's going to be a stepping stone out further in getting our public up to speed. We're, we've got teams that are already out in the Milky Way galaxy and interstellar trade. How do they get that reality joined up with a planet that has been told for 5,000 years that we're alone in the universe? It, 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 the, it's schizophrenic. So it's possible that he has been exposed to the need for the space force because it has to be a public space force in which they can then take the interstellar trade people and everything that's going on, once they've covered it up officially, okay, space force, it could cover up 40 years of going out into the Milky Way galaxy and the same on Mars. When Musk announced, was it six weeks ago? He said that he was gonna take Uh, starting in 2024 as the earliest possible date, maybe 2026, that he was going to have his, I call them star cruisers, going from Earth to Mars, and he was going to have enough of them made that they would be like a baton relay. And that he said, on the record, you can do a search and find this, that by 2030, that's only nine and a half years, by 2030, He would have one million Homo sapien sapien from Earth in a base on Mars functioning. And the first thing that hit me when I was reading that, what does Elon Musk know? (laughs) What has he been read into? That means that there is some urgency to get a million people from Earth on Mars. What else do they know could be coming, could be happening, that they want to make sure that they really have a large contingency of Homo sapiens sapien on a planet quite a way away from Earth? Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Support us on Patreon.com for $1.99 a month to watch our full shoot interviews ad-free and help our channel grow. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.